As Elizabeth Podest and Andre Kastrobit's journey continues on 90 Day Fiancé. Happily Ever After? Season 7, there are more and more indications that the couple and Elizabeth's family will soon get their own spin-off from TLC. Libby and Andre are no strangers to the 90 Day Fiancé franchise and have been featured on multiple shows for multiple seasons often, accompanied by Libby's parents and siblings. However, their family drama is often criticized by fans who think the family is toxic and have accused TLC of staging scenes. In Season 7, the conflict in the Potest Kastrovit family is as tense as ever. While Libby attempts to pursue her dream of singing nursery rhymes, Andre faces threats of deportation, and the whole family is still reeling from Andre and his brother-in-law, Charlie Potest's violent fight from last season. But if viewers were hoping for the family to have learned and grown from what they went through, they were sorely mistaken. Libby's sisters Jen and Becky Pottest already went back on their claim that they wouldn't spend time with Charlie unless he addressed his drinking problem, while Libby and Andre have held firm. Although many fans are tired of their drama, there are signs that viewers will see a lot more of the Pottists. Libby and Andre are getting a good edit on Happily Ever After on Happily Ever After. Season 7, Andre and Libby are coming off well suspiciously well. In the past the show has highlighted their more unlikable behaviors and attitudes, but this season the two seem surprisingly reasonable. They are the only ones in the family to stand firm against Charlie, and fans can understand their desire to not expose their daughter to his behavior while under the influence. Libby and Andre seem more level-headed than ever, and it could be because TLC is priming them to be the stars of their own spin-off, while Libby's family are poised to be the source of conflict. The Pottest siblings are getting storylines though the focus of Happily Ever After is supposed to be Libby and Andre, viewers are getting a lot more of the rest of the Pottest family this season. An entire segment was dedicated to Charlie taking pictures of his wife Megan's feet and explaining their booming OnlyFans business. The other Pottest siblings have also been featured in scenes without Andre and Libby, and it looks like they're starting to take a more central role in the storyline. TLC may be attempting to expand on the other Pottists as characters the same way Chantal Everett's family members became cast members on the family Chantal. Libby Pottest's pregnancy could mark the start of a new series fans who follow Libby on Instagram are well aware that she is currently pregnant with her second child and is set to give birth soon. However, the topic of her pregnancy has not yet been broached on Happily Ever After. It's possible that her pregnancy won't come up until the end of season 7, which would be the perfect segue into a spin-off show. A new series focused on Libby and Andre would center around their second pregnancy while balancing their relationship with the rest of Libby's family. Libby's pregnancy could serve as a seamless transition to the family Pottest. There's been no official word about Libby and Andre landing a spin-off show, but based on how long they've been in the franchise and how their storyline on 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After, is going, it's entirely possible. There are rumors that the family Chantal will not be returning for season 5 due to Chantal and Pedro Jimeno's divorce, so TLC may have an open slot in the schedule. The Pottest family solo show may be the last thing fans want, but that hasn't stopped TLC before. The same network that has shoved the likes of Big Ed Brown and Angela Deem down viewers' throats for years would probably be more than happy to greenlight a Pottest family spin-off. Just to be, 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 just to be
Bang the street, bang the street, bang the street, bang the street.